we have a huge construction milestone update and more coming up next. What is up everyone? This is Damien the Disney Hacker here today. I'm giving you guys an update for the month of June here from downtown Disney. If you're new to this channel, welcome you guys are already part of the D3 Hacker family. Welcome back to the ride. Let's get this party started. We officially begin our update this month, folks, here at a new entrance, a western entrance here at downtown Disney, right across the way from the Disneyland Hotel. Look how amazing this new entrance looks, folks. You can see the letters on top of the awning right there, the roof, spelled downtown Disney. This is awesome, folks. I love the new entryway here into the western portion of the downtown Disney complex over here to walk around and get a better clear view look at that marquee that looks amazing folks nice and clean the security is pretty quick they have new not scanning devices but you know they have more efficient a little bit more efficient way with the plexiglasses up right there with that being said folks we're going to get through security and check back in on the other side of security and give you guys a update on the construction going on at downtown Disney. With that being said, folks, let's go. We continue our adventure here at the opposite end on the inside portion of the new entrance of the western side of downtown Disney. Folks, you can see the new restaurants right there in front of us, as well as you can see the back side of the security line, which have plexi windows up right now to help expedite the process of getting through the security line here. But we plan around and going to continue our walk through the rest of the construction area here at the western portion of downtown Disney. You can see the Ding Tai Fung restaurant right there is almost open, folks. Wow, look at that. And I believe right here, I think they had a mural up. Hopefully this might be the new spot of portals, but the rest of this area over here is going to be the park side market over on the other side. But look at this area, folks. This whole viewing spot for live music in this area is like live is jamming right now folks wow so after you see the kids running around playing and everything like that it's beautiful over here this is what this area is supposed to be like but what we're going to do we're going to continue our construction update over here as we walk through the crowd and get a close-up on a parkside market update over here in this construction portion of the video. Then after that, we're gonna go check out some of the new merch at some of the stores. But here's the Parkside Market construction right here, folks. Moving right along, hopefully later this summer, it'll be opened up. And I think they're gonna have a bar that goes along with it. We're gonna take a look at the sign again for you guys. There it is, the Parkside Market right there. That's what it's gonna look like. Then, oh, they got a sit and sauna in a parkside bar and a chicken shop right there. Looks amazing. But the guys, if you guys want to know, the initial, oh, they have a Soul Sister restaurant as well. But if you guys want to know, their initial opening, security opening for, for the Western End by uh, Disneyland Hotel is currently closed. Right there. That's currently closed off right there on the construction. So I'm not sure that entrance is going to open exclusively for the Disneyland hotel guests or not but yeah that portion is closed right there but that's the update here as far as construction on the western end of downtown Disney but what we're going to do now folks we're going to continue to walk through downtown Disney I'm going to give you guys an update on some of the new merch number one in the Lego store number two we're going to check out the Disney dress shop and number three we're going to check out the Disney home store and last but not least we're going to check out the World of Disney store here at Downtown Disney. As you can see, folks, very, very busy here in the month of June. I hope you guys are having a great year out there. I can't believe it's June already. So it's summertime, folks. Graduation season here in June. The crowds are big. With that being said, folks, let's go to our first little update here at Downtown Disney inside of the Lego store right beyond the monorail tracks right here we're gonna hop inside of the lego store right now with that being said folks let's go we are inside of the lego store here at downtown disney folks we are looking 
at the new NASA Legos Icons NASA Ultimate Space Launch System Lego set, which is for $260. This looks incredible, folks, for all you serious Lego nerds out there. Well, let's see what else they have here in the Lego store here at Downtown Disney. We are staying with the space exploration theme right here, folks. You have the Space Shuttle Discovery on sale for $200 right here. You have the Tales of the Space Age set for $50. And you have the Space Station right here going for $110. This is inside of the Lego store here at Downtown Disney. We have the Notre Dame Cathedral here in the Lego store, folks. And it's also on sale for $230. Wow, this is an incredible Lego set right here. It has about 4,383 pieces. Serious is for you serious Lego maniacs out there. This is incredible, folks. We have the Lego Icons Lord of the Rings um, Lego set right here. This is going for, I believe, $460 for your hardcore Lego fanatics out there. They have early access the first weekend of June. This is totally incredible. We are inside of a Disney dress shop here at Downtown Disney, folks. You have this wonderful Dohe and Birch collection right here. You're looking at the It's a Small World bag in front of you for $328 right there. Right there below it, you have the wallet that goes with it for $188 along with the mini ears right there for $35. Right below, you have the Wish wallet right there for $188 and the Wish bag at the bottom it goes along with it for three twenty-eight dollars right there. And you have the Wish Ears at the bottom for $35. Again, this is inside of the World of Disney store here. It, not the World of Disney, inside of the Disney dress shop here at Downtown Disney. We've made our way over to the World of Disney store here at Downtown Disney, folks. You see this amazing Disney Pride collection display right here. You have the Starbucks tumblers right there. And these amazing Pride t-shirts. Let's go to the other side of the display. I saw some cool merch on the other side. You have this nice Pride t-shirt right here. The basic Pride t-shirts. I think these are going like for $40. But this is what I want to show you guys, folks. This right here is fire. Look at this jersey. This jersey right here, this Pride jersey, is $75. This is so cool. And you also have this Pride Spirit jersey right here which is also amazing. I think this is going for the standard like $85, $95. And you have this nice throw right here at the bottom. I think these are going for like, how much is these? These are going for $70. Again, this is inside the World of Disney Store. Let's see what else they have here that's new on display. You have more amazing Pride collection merchandise right here, folks. You have this Mickey's Pride sweatshirt right here for $55. And right next to it, you have this white with the um, sweatshirt as well. I think this is for $55. This is for $60, stop, $60 over here. Come around the corner. Yeah, this amazing t-shirt right here. Pride t-shirts right here on display. And this awesome button-down Pride t-shirt. How much is this one? This is going for $65. And on the opposite end of the display, of course you have your lounge line right there. I think that's going for like your standard $75 right there. And yeah, this very cool Pride sweatshirt right here, Disney World, Disney Club Resort sweatshirt for $60. And again, you have the same Mickey sweatshirt on the other side. I think that's for the same price as well. Again, this is inside the World of Disney Store. Let's see what else cool, other cool merchandise they have. You have this amazing new Disney Eats collection right here. These new lounge fly, this mint chocolate, this chocolate ice cream, mint chocolate ice cream design right here for your lounge fly for $88. And you have this mint chocolate Mickey sandwich ice cream ears for $40 right here. Well, let's make a way around. I think they have a sweatshirt to match. Yes, they have a sweatshirt right here, folks. Not the sweatshirts, but they have the they have the spirit jerseys. This is awesome, folks. These spirit jerseys look amazing to match with your Mickey ears and your also your lounge fly. I think these are going for let's see. Here's the price right here. These are actually, I think they are about the same as the other ones, like around ballpark $75, $85 in the same price range. Again, this is inside the World of Disney store here at Downtown Disney. You have this amazing new Inside Out 2 merch right here in front of you. On your left, 
you have this amazing button down shirt with all the emotions on it for $65. And on the right, you have this nice, awesome Believe in Yourself t-shirt for $35. Again, this is inside of the Ronald Disney Store here in downtown Disney. We continue with the Inside Out 2 merchandise here in downtown Disney, folks. You can see the new Anxiety emotion right here for $22. And you also have the other new emotions at the bottom. I believe this one right here is uh, embarrassment right here. This one, big plush right here, is for $30. This is really cool. I cannot wait to see Inside Out 2 movie. The new Inside Out 2 movie, folks. Again, this is inside the World of Disney Store here at Downtown Disney. Well, DP Hackers, this concludes your update for the month of June here at Downtown Disney. I hope you enjoyed this episode like I did. Now, I'd like to hear from you, DP Hackers. What was your favorite part of this episode here at Downtown Disney? Was it a new construction up at a new entryway here at Downtown Disney? Or was it a cool new merchandise in the side of the World of Disney store? Feel free to leave a comment below. This should be fun. In the meantime, if you guys are still having your Disneyland withdrawals, feel free to check out my channel where I have some fun, amazing Disneyland tips and some fun and amazing Disneyland adventures to help you get your Disney fix. Thanks again for watching, everyone. Remember to follow me on all social media platforms. See you guys real soon.